Shalom. What a wonderful way to wish somebody peace be upon you. The Hebrew language word Shalom. I'm Mary Manchula Suhasini. I thank and praise God for this opportunity to learn Hebrew language. Our pastor Rabbi, who's teaching the Hebrew language letters and so many insights and truths of the Bible. Thank you, Pastor. It's like going through the whole Bible from creation. You see it live or you feel it. So it's so wonderful to learn Hebrew language. And each letter of Hebrew language is a story by itself. And every letter of Hebrew language points to Jesus Christ. And it is pictorial. So every letter has a picture which applies to different meanings and particular meanings and makes it very easy to follow. Like beginning from Aleph, the first letter, also in Greek called Alpha. So many of these letters in Hebrew are taken for Greek language too. So side by side we get to know both the language alphabet. And we learn uh, Greek alphabet also is more interesting. It's easier to follow also. And it is amazing to know so many truths and insights of the word which we don't find in the English version of the Bible. Each Hebrew letter has so many meanings and the pastor being an expert in the language and studied so much teaches us many aspects of Bible in many a way through Hebrew language. It's an experience than just learning an amazing one that too. Pastor Ravi also clearly explains of the connectivity of each alphabet with the other letter and how each letter's meaning is well explained with Bible references. I'm so blessed to be in this particular group, the third batch, named after the third alphabet called Gimel, which means one of the meanings is gift of God. And it's so good to know how many times each alphabet letter is used in Torah. Never knew Hebrew language was read backwards. Nice. So good to know Merik, the soup is a Hebrew word which we Hyderabadis enjoy so much as a special dish at the wedding specially. And how Sabbath means the day of the Lord and what it means and how Jesus gives us rest. And the point from uh, a print form of the Hebrew letters seem constructed and complicated but to make it easier uh, the writing pastor has taught us how to write it in an easier manner and then it's so comforting to know how Jesus is constantly cleansing his church through this language and never understood before how a letter can be constructed in Hebrew into a word and so meaningfully and also truths like it's not my being righteous is good enough but it is actually a gift of God the righteousness and why we should speak more about Christ one letter itself tells you and how Jesus is Aleph and Fela every letter has a letter value or numerical value and cardinal value and so many different meanings and how did a donkey speak in Hebrew language is very interesting and what's a monkey doing in the scriptures all the more and I'm still learning and wish to know much more and which is bringing me day after day closer to Lord Jesus and to God with each lesson so I want more. God bless you, Pastor Ravi. 
and uh, for reaching out to all of us and um, pray that you reach out to many more through the Hebrew language and the language, the first language I would say of the mankind. Thank God. Thank you Pastor Ravi. Shalom to everybody.